Regret is a bitch, but it can be a powerful ally and one of the best motivators you can use. Here's the big question. How do action takers like us, who don't wait on fate or luck, overcome all the shit that holds most people back, gain the skills and confidence against all odds, and be happier, fulfilled, and badass in all areas of life? That's the question. This gives the answers. My name is Jeff Lasaria. Welcome to Badass Confidence. It's fucking rock and roll. What's up, badasses? It's been a while. Ever since COVID-19 happened, I usually shoot these podcasts right in my car, right after work, on my drives since I've been busy with entrepreneurship. This is gonna be a short but complete one. It's based on a social media post that is doing extremely well for me that I posted on my page on Facebook. Follow me on Facebook. It's facebook.com slash Jeff today. J-E-F-F-T-O-D-A-Y. I post a lot of different content. Follow me there. So here's the post. Regret is a powerful motivator. If I'm in between making decisions, I'll look at if I'll regret it. If I don't take that chance. It's how I got my first real experience as a dating coach, coaching students from all over the world in Las Vegas. I applied to one of the biggest live training dating programs and companies and flew to Las Vegas so they could see how I do with the students. The plane ride was one of the most nerve wracking plane rides of my life. My stomach dropped. I had to keep myself from stop. I had to stop myself from shaking and I just wanted to throw up all my emotions into the white paper bag in front of me. And we haven't even taken off yet. I'm not even a nervous or anxious person, but the pressure felt immense. It was the uncertainty, it was the unknown, it was the doubts if I could provide any value to the students. What did they even want to see from me exactly? When I first got the call, I was excited. And then a flutter of nervous washed over me. Can I really do this? There was a slight moment of doubt. And then I thought, if I didn't do this, if I didn't try, would I regret it more than showing up and failing? And the answer was a resounding yes. This was a once in a lifetime opportunity. I'd rather show up and be completely inadequate and fail on my face than live with the regret of always wondering what if regret is a bitch but it can also be one of the most powerful motivators for you to get up take action despite what you feel looking at your future self and seeing yourself in that moment think about you regretting the decision of not taking action today so if there's anything else holding you back and it's holding you down mentally. It's stressing you out and you want to return to some type of normalcy, but you can't right now. Switch the frame to how can you? What do you need to do to be able to, instead of filtering for all the reasons why you can't, you only need one way to figure out how. Share this with a person that you know needs to hear this message because there are times in our life when we choose not to. And then there's gonna be those moments where we sit back and we live with that lingering, what if?